For this exercise, I want you to stand behind your chair. So stay facing me, put the chair in front of you and you're gonna keep your hands on the chair. Feet are hip width apart. So if you're not sure, feet together, toes out, heels out, center of the hips, center of the knees, center of the ankles, not shoulder width, hip width. And all I'm gonna ask you to do is bend your knees and try and sit slightly backwards as if you're sitting in a chair. Now, how low you go is up to you. I'm only looking for mini squats here. The reason for asking you to sit, stand behind a chair is that I don't want your knees coming a long way forward. I want you to think about sitting back. This exercise works the quads, which is the thighs, and the glutes, which is your bum. So we really want to feel that in the bum. Also, really be aware with this. Very easy. I'll show you to arch your back as you come down. Try not to do that. Keep the pelvis tucked under. Keep your back in neutral as you come down and lift back up. Coming down. Now I can come down quite a long way, my quads are quite strong, but you go with what works for you and I don't care if you're only moving half an inch or even an inch. So for you, if that is, is working for you, if you can feel that small movement working, then that's exactly right for you. Stay facing me. Think about your posture, so you're keeping that pelvis tucked. You're keeping the head up right, lengthening the back of the neck, retracting the chin, keeping those shoulders relaxed. You're using this for support and to watch that you're not bringing the knees all the way in. Think about sitting back as if you're sitting back in a chair and lift. Down and lift. Couple more if you can. Really good for the muscles supporting the knees. Okay, give a little shake out. 